All right, Scotty, how's it going over here? <sighs> Tiring. All right. But we're getting there slowly but surely. We're on the driver's side now. I got the front just kind of in place. And we're going to get this guy up. <clears throat> We need to go where? Front, back. Think about where's that tool at? Uh, oh, front. shit. What's happening? That is not going to fit this time. So now we got to figure out where we're at. Boy. Let's see. See if you can go on the back side of the tire. Oh, you do. I don't know what you did or how you did it. I don't even know how I did Three, it. Three, two, one. No, you're gonna have to get that back in there again for just a second. Sorry guys, I hit the button. Sorry guys, I keep hitting the button. So you know what? We'll just show you in just a minute when it's together because it'll make life easier. So we'll let you go for the moment. Burnsy did it. Got it. He got us all set so we can get the, the nut on that didn't take long. Nope. Thank friggin' God. So now I'll have him jack up the differential. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ow. Well, you know, hey, we gotta have you jack something. I mean, come on, you know, we're at work. All right, come on. We, so get, we get paid to do this. <laughs> <laughs> and, wait, wait, wait. Please break it. It's fine. Right. Nope. We're right. Front. And we're going to have to have you push again on the differential this way. Oh, yeah. That'll straighten it out. It's it's the leaf springs. Okay. So you were right. The leaf spring is what's going to center it. So yeah, it'll I be. Yeah, because once it sits, it'll actually kind of yep. come backwards. I know it looks a little off when it's first. Uh... Yep. You're right. You're right. Oh, wait, 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 down, no, because we got a lot, we got a good inch and a half. Oh, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep giving, it, it's going, you're going to have to really give it some ass. Keep going, keep going. Oh, I'm going to drop it down. And we'll get back to you guys in a minute. I need my hands as well. How's it going over there, Scotty? We're getting there. We got that. Finally got it in place. The rubber moved on us, so I had to loosen everything up, set it on a jack stand, fix the top. Now it's just trying to get everything in place so that I can tighten everything up and get... And I think, I think, I think, well not really, I gave it up for a win. If you follow that sort of thing. <laughs> Do you know how you know Scotty's an old school mechanic? Uh, he doesn't use power tools. Yeah. <laughs> Every job I've ever had being a mechanic, he's like, I got power tools. And Sometimes it's just easier not to use power tools. It is. And sometimes working on older because, cars. Because, no, here's the fun part. Fit it in there. What do you mean it doesn't fit? I know, more lube. Yeah, just a little bit. Just a little bit. Hear that tone change? Oh yeah. And yes, I remembered nut and bolt. I was gonna say, <laughs> we're not gonna forget this time, are we? No, we're not. That's cool. All right, we'll get back with you guys in just a moment. 
We're about to put tires on and dropping it down so you can see the back end done. Yeah, baby. All right, Scotty. So you got we are down all four. I'm not liking it. Not that I don't like the stance. Love the stance, but yes. It's just too far forward. And we centered everything on the leaf springs. Yes, we did. Both sides. So now if we look at the other side. It's the same way. Nice. Now, it could just be me being excessively picky. Get the fingers in there. Yeah, I mean, nothing's rubbing, which is fine. And bounce but on the back. To uh, me, that doesn't sit right. Yeah, there's a lot of space in the back, so you think. But I'm not a, a van person or a truck person, so that might be exactly how it's supposed to sit with this type of suspension system on it. Yeah. I truly don't know. So I'll have to get a hold of the boss and see what he thinks and go from there. But to me, I don't think it's right. But like I said, it could be 100% perfect. I just want to make sure that it's 100% perfect. I don't want anything ever leaving the shop that's not exactly that, ever. I just don't. So, but yeah, we'll get a hold of the boss, see what he thinks, and we'll do a quickie test drive, make sure everything's good. There's no clunking, no bumping, which there shouldn't be. I mean. We were spot on with everything we did, torqued and tightened. So, okay, we'll go from there, guys, and we'll see you on the next one.